Hey, welcome back to the Far Outpost. All right, do we have a tree today? One of the benefits of moving to Indiana is that we're only a couple hours from Columbus, which is of course where Rogue is headquartered. So we made one pilgrimage to get the uh, Arnold um, Amateur Strongman Husafel Stone at 198 pounds. I'll show you that at the end of the video, but that's not why you're here. Why you're here is for these. Rogue, so as you all know, right before we started our gym, uh, Arnold went from the Hummer deadlift tire to a stainless steel machined 45 pound plate with his image on it. At the time, of course, all of the gym, we were just starting, so we, we knew they were kind of the, the holy grail, but we didn't know enough about them to know anything other than the fact that Arnold, <laughs> Arnold had a set. But at the time, Rogue mentioned that it was a few thousand dollars to make each individual plate after the, the labor cost, the machine time, and the CNC machine, and that there wasn't any way for them to do this to a, to a customer that would be cost effective. So it wasn't ever gonna happen. Fast forward to this year, for whatever reason, we all woke up Saturday to a, an Instagram from Rogue that said, a limited batch, 500 pairs, so 1,000 plates, were being made and released on Saturday. You had to come down in person to the Rogue shop to get them. So my wife and I jumped in the car and we made a pilgrimage. It is now Sunday morning. <laughs> we drove six hours today to get a, the Holy Grail plate. I've wanted this basically since I started my gym. But this is what they come. They come shipped in the normal 45 pound, um, the 45 pound deep dish box. They are made in Michigan, just like the other deeps. All they have is a different mold. So they're still um, the same type of material. They're still eco covered. Once you get them home though, and you pull them out, this is what you get. Look at that. Ah! Arnold! <laughs> All right, now let's talk about what you want to know because you're probably wondering, hey, later this week when these are for sale online, whatever doesn't sell will be available online. Are they worth it? Uh, a normal set of 45s is going to run you $180 and to ship it to me, it's $38. Okay, these are $275. So after shipping, you're north of $300. Since I drove to Ohio and got them myself, I just paid Ohio tax. These were $295 even on my, on my card for me to leave. So that means they should have been around $235, right? $233 shipped. So if that's just, if you're not a huge Arnold fan like I was, obviously Arnold's in the gym. He's, you know, when I started lifting as a child, Arnold was the guy I followed and wanted to be in all the action movies. He's, he's significant to my adolescence, right? <laughs> so I, I needed these. But if you don't need these or if $320 is just obscene to you, I totally get it. I think this is actually a situation where Rogue is testing the fanboys. They're seeing what our nostalgia is worth, right? And my nostalgia is worth a six hour car ride, <laughs> three there and three back, a couple of minutes inside a Rogue to test out some barbells and then $295. So that's what that's, but this is probably the breaking point. If they had come out and they had made these 350 or 400, like 200 a plate or something like that, I doubt you see them right now. It just wouldn't make any sense for us. We've got plenty of stuff to lift, but this, like I said, it just was so kind of special for me that I, I needed to go get it. So anyway, this is what they are. The rest of them, they are just, like I said, they are a, a standard E-coat, 45 pound deep dish. There's no other, um, no other greatness to them outside of, sorry, the box is falling. No other greatness to them outside of the fact that they have this raised silhouette. And now you get to see where we're gonna put them in the gym going forward. We've got the far outpost deep dishes up here. And now we're gonna cover them with the Arnolds. Who? All right, really quick before you go, let me show you the first thing that we went up for we went up Friday, Sticks and Stone made these. He made the odd implement carries uh, this year for the amateur strongman events. He made boxes, he made fire hydrants, he made uh, replica Husafels. So as you know, the real Husafel in Iceland's 440 pounds. This comes in at 198, which for us is plenty. They had another version at the games or at the Arnold Strongman that was 330, I believe, or 340. And I just felt like this was gonna actually get used more, right? You get over 300 pounds and there's only a certain 
a certain amount of people that can come over and do anything with that. Whereas this is a good weight. So that was the first trip Friday to Ohio. And these were the second trip uh, this morning. So, hey, I hope you have a great time out there. Leave me any questions that you want. Um, I'm pretty transparent. It's just a, a transaction for weights. So there's not a lot to hide. Everyone gets one pair. So whether you get them online later in the week or you run up to Ohio today before four, you get one, one purchase, two plates, that's it. Hey, thanks for stopping by. Have a great week out there, everybody.